Pair and tuple. A tour of C++, concurrency and utilities. Often, we need some data that is just data, that is, a collection of values, rather than an object of a class with a well-defined semantics and an invariant for its value. In such cases, we could define a simple struct with an appropriate set of appropriately named members. Alternatively, we could let the standard library write the definition for us. For example, the standard library algorithm equal range returns a pair of iterators specifying a subsequence meeting a predicate. Template type name forward iterator, type name t, type name compare. Pair forward iterator, forward iterator. Equal range, forward iterator first, forward iterator last, const t and val, compare cmp. Given a sorted sequence, first, last, equal range, will return the pair representing the subsequence that matches the predicate CMP. We can use that to search in a sorted sequence of records. Auto rec eq equals const record address of R1, const record address of R2, return R1.name less than R2.name, compare names. Void f, const vector record address of v. Assume that v is sorted on its name field. Auto or equals equal range, v.begin, v.end, record, reg, rec eq. 4, auto p equals er dot first, p not equal er dot second, plus plus p. Print all equal records. C out pointer to P, assume that left shift operator is defined for record. The first member of a pair is called first and the second member is called second. This naming is not particularly creative and may look a bit odd at first, but such consistent naming is a boon when we want to write generic code. The standard library pair, from utility, is quite frequently used in the standard library and elsewhere. A pair provides operators, such as equals, 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 and less than, if its elements do. The make pair function makes it easy to create a pair without explicitly mentioning its type. For example, void f, vector string address of v, auto p, p equals make pair, v dot begin, 2, p, p is a pair vector string, iterator, int. If you need more than two elements, or less, you can use tuple, from utility. A tuple is a heterogeneous sequence of elements, for example. Tuple string in double T2, sild 123, 3.14, the type is explicitly specified. Auto T equals make tuple, string, herring, 10, 1.23, the type is deduced. T is a tuple string in double. String S equals get 0, T, get first element of tuple. Index equals get 1, T. Double D equals get 2, T. The elements of a tuple are numbered, starting with 0, rather than named the way elements of pairs are, first and second. To get compile time selection of elements, I must unfortunately use the ugly get 1, T, rather than get T1, or T1. Like pairs, tuples can be assigned and compared if their elements can be. A pair is common in interfaces because often we want to return more than one value, 
such as a result and an indicator of the quality of that result. It is less common to need three or more parts to a result, so tuples are more often found in the implementations of generic algorithms. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.